Hi guys, greetings of the day, myself uh, Vijay Tawadhan and in this video lecture session I am going to show you a solution on projection of plane surfaces. And the problem is like this, a rectangular lamina of sides 20 mm by 25 mm has an edge in HP and adjoining edges in VP. It is tilted such that the front view appears as a rectangle of 20 mm by 15 mm. The edge which is in VP is 30 mm from the right profile plane. Draw the top view, front view, left side view in this position. Find its inclination with the corresponding principal plane. So this problem can be solved like thus. So initially one has to construct a 20 by 25 mm rectangle and which is on HP and adjoining edges in VP and it is tilted such that the front view appears as a rectangle as 20 by 15 mm means the lamina is positioned on HP but the, it is parallel to VP because it is inclined to VP when it is inclined to VP uh, the 20 by 25 becomes 20 by 15 after its inclinations so now how to solve this problem uh, let me show you make use of a line command with a thickness of 0 0.13 mm so one has to construct a xy line and after constructing an xy line using the text command one can name the endpoints of these line can be named as x and y and then to represent the first quadrant one has to name above the xy line as vp below the xy line as hp then make use of a rectangle command with a thickness of 0 0.5 millimeter width is supposed to be 25 millimeter and height is supposed to be 20 millimeter and angle is supposed to be 0 degree and the line is on HP that is the lamina is on HP and its front view is going to look like 20 by 15 so henceforth it should be on XY line but it should be drawn in the VP now by doing it so so one can understand that this is 20 and this 25 mm is going to be reduced to 15 mm after rotation next make use of uh, the text command and uh, one can give the namings of the corner this will be taken as a dash and this could be taken as b dash and this could be taken as uh, c dash and accordingly this will can be taken as d dash and then in the same fashion when i am going to draw the top view the top view has to be drawn on the x y line now when I go to draw the top view, this point will become B as well as A and then this point will become C as well as D. So this completes the top and front views constructions as per the given conditions. Then the same rectangle, the reduced length is 15 millimeter. Now one has to go to the rectangle command with a thickness of 0 0.5 the width is to be reduced from 25 to 15 millimeter and the height remains same as 20 millimeter one has to reconstruct a rectangle and that has to be positioned on the xy line at an angle of 0 degree then after doing it so so according to the given names this corner will become a dash and this corner will become b dash this corner will be c dash and this corner will be d dash then we know that the height remains the same hence join the projector d dash to a dash and d dash henceforth now one can see that the height has been fixed and this rectangle size has been reduced from 25 to 15 millimeter this is what the reduced size and for this getting this reduction what is the inclination has to happen now one can see that AB is on the XY line itself and whereas CD is going to move away from vertical plane in front of VP. Now how to do that one? Make use of a line command with a thickness of 0 0.13. One can extend that CD portion in the HP. That is the it is moving in front of VP. Then what is the length of the front view the length of the sorry uh, what is the length of the top view the length of the top view is 25 millimeter so go to the arc by center point command select a dash as well as b dash that is nothing but the top view a b as the center and the radius value must be taken as 25 millimeter 
one has to draw an arc here to get the position of C and D when it is inclined at when it is uh, the front view is going to look like 15 by 20 millimeter then join these end points then make use of the text command name this corner as A as well as B and in the same fashion this corner will be named as C and D. Now this completes the condition of uh, 20 by 15 mm and then the next condition is the edge on which VP is 30 mm from the right profile plane. Now the edge is in VP. Now this is the edge which is in VP A dash B dash is having 30 mm from the right profile plane. So one has to construct a right profile plane using a line command with thickness of 0 0.13. Let us construct the right profile plane whose distance from a dash b dash line to the x1 y1 line is supposed to be 30 millimeter and after which we are supposed to draw the top and front views now this is the top view and this is the front view which is already drawn and the left side view in this position to draw the left side view in this position make use of a line command with the thickness of 0 0.13 from the intersection of these lines one has to draw a construction line whose angle is supposed to be 45 degree so make use of angle between command show that this angle is 45 degree after making these necessary changes make use of a move command sorry line command with a 0.13 mm thing <coughs> project c and d till the 45 degree line and the c is on x y line and d is on this height so the projector D dash is going to be connected up to here whereas AB is going to be connected on this line and it is going to move on the X1 Y1 line. So make use of a text command name this uh, end point of a line as X1 and this point as Y1 and after which now CD is moving this will become C double dash and this will become D double dash. So make use of a text command, mark this point as C double dash and this point is going to be the D double dash accordingly A will be on the exact intersection of X1 Y1 line that will be named as A double dash sorry uh, it is a B and here it will be A double dash then make use of a line command with a thickness of 0 0.5 millimeter one can join the intersection here a dash to b dash and then b dash to c dash here the b dash to c dash is supposed to be okay and then uh, d dash and then back to a dash now one can see that the left side view has been completed make use of a text command and mark this point as rpp and then lsv that is right profile plane and the left side view has been generated now the condition A is satisfied and what is condition B find its inclination with the corresponding principal plane which is the corresponding principal plane vertical plane what is the inclination of the vertical plane with respect to this lamina that we have to project it now using the angle between command so one can measure this angle which is measuring as 53 degrees now this completes the required constructions as per the given conditions so this completes the problem and if anybody is having any sort of doubt to solve this problem you can call me at any point of time and please do share this video to all the first year engineering students and also do subscribe to my youtube channel thank you guys thanks for watching the video